Paul's music. Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. If you're new to my channel, it's Tamika. I upload videos once a week, which is Sunday, and then I also throw in bonus videos throughout the week. And with that being said, you all, I am here to share. This particular video is to let you know what bag I ended up keeping. So if you want to see what bag Miss Tamika ended up keeping, then y'all know what y'all need to do. Y'all need to go ahead and click on that subscribe button, you all, because it really, 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 really helps out my channel. So with that being said, we're going to go ahead and jump straight into this here video. I don't know, really quick backstory. I did purchase a total of three bags. I had to repurchase one of the first bags. See all that in the video. Ended up keeping... Drum roll, please. Mm. I'm going with the bigger bag, and I'm gonna tell you why. Her up here, really pretty, so y'all can see her in this here video. Love the BB, I think it was the BB. Love the style of that particular bag. To second BB was because of the fact that wrong with it after I turned the camera off. So I was like, okay, I really like this bag, I'm gonna go ahead and reorder the bag you know hopefully fingers crossed you know everything is perfect yes, which it was but i ended up going to the louis vuitton store to take in one of my luggage tags the louis vuitton store to check on my high-rise bum bag there i was like you know what let me look at some bags so my sa a lot of different bags i ended up with the size of this here particular bag because with that size of a bag because everything in my high rise bum bag was able to fit in that particular bag but i was just like okay uh tamika if this is going to be a bag that you're going to carry for a long time do you want to have to struggle with trying to fit your vlogging camera trying to fit your cell phone pink i did like the pink but y'all already know my issue with light interior is this particular strap off of amazon it's made out of leather i didn't even know i left the clear plastic on it i wanted to show you the bag far as what i have in the bag so we're going to start off with what's in my bag the bag i did get the monogram with the black interior i was not playing y'all i did not want nothing light it's the bag and i do have it stuffed just so you can see that this hair bag this hair bag carries a lot and when i say a lot a lot it can actually fit an ipad um my, what i'm going to do is just pull stuff out to show you what i have in this particular bag so i do have my chanel card case was able to carry my chanel wallet but i couldn't carry like a whole lot of other things and i wanted to start using my pouches like you know my slgs and i wasn't able to do that with the smaller version bag i can use like almost all of my slgs if i wanted to far as the little pouches and then i also have my glossier 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 lotion i have a pack of tissues it says you can do anything and i got this here from um where i get this from target Really quick it has two sides so i'm just pulling from the one side my cell phone like i said i have the 14 pro max chanel pouch like i said i wanted to start using my you know slgs and this here is one of the pouches that i wanted to start using again um i did get this here off a of fashion file it was pre-love of it i would have preferred to got it from the chanel store because i did have to pay a little more but it's okay I got my Chanel piece in the color pink. My car keys. And I have my Chanel lip gloss. A Walmart receipt. I have my Chanel blotting sheets. My um, lip gloss. They don't touch land hand sanitizer. And then I have my bling fragrance. It is refillable. Fragrance I have in here. I think I have that Ariana Grande like body spray we got from um marshall's or tj maxx i got it for my daughter also i had put some in here if i if you wanted to see how much it holds so that's everything on that particular side now we're going to go on to the other side and i have my gucci pouch my ysl lip balm hermes lip balm 
so pull out my um, pochette another Chanel um, two picks a Killian fragrance and a um, nail file the pen yeah I have a pen in here as well going strong you all I had this for a very very long time I think I purchased this when it was under 500 go receipt what did I buy uh, I had brought my daughter some um, women products I have my gum this here is for mints from Lido's but I use it for my gum I don't know it's just cuter to carry than this I have a mint that I got from work Givenchy um, lip have my Dior in the limited edition packaging. I also have a Pat McGrath lip. I did get this hair particular lip from um, TJ Maxx. So as you can see, the inside on both sides are empty. I'm gonna go into the middle. If y'all didn't know, the middle do have a zip pocket. It is attached where you cannot pull it out and use it as like a clutch or anything connected to the bottom so your things do roll from side to side little zipper pocket i have my limited edition chanel mirror not worth the money but i got suckered in um youtube made me do it my christian dior lotion YouTube and social media sometimes you get suckered into things you really don't need or me i'm buying stuff i sometimes don't need but i have cut back like I've had been controlling myself because at one point in time I was just buying whatever cute I see I was buying but I had to I had to slow up on some things moving on to my airpods y'all know I need my airpods wherever I go car wash coupon oh I forgot I have this and my bath and body works um coupon I, I always keep my uh, bag information inside of all my bags YSL lip mirror I I have my medicine and I get a lot of questions about this particular um, get this from the container store that down below as well if I can find it I do have another keychain that says popcorn and this is also from my son from Saudi Arabia because he knows I love popcorn I have my blinged out uh, medicine um, holder keep in there to be honest y'all is like Tylenol because a lot of times I get headaches from stressing or um just life well, that was everything inside of the middle pocket but the bag is completely empty and let you a few my shots so you can see how it looks on my particular body I have like i said let me show you the features of the bag really quick you have a drawstring where you can pull the bag tight if you want pair a lot smaller um baton uh written on these here little gold circles I have Louis Vuitton here as well on the straps and in Paris you also have Louis Vuitton on this hair front strap not sure if you can see it but you do have Louis Vuitton written here as well I have any feet I'm not going to do it but I did see a lot of people take these hair take this whole strap off and put in a bandeau like those scarves and used it as a, a bow and that was cute, but I'm not going to do all that. If I do add any type of extraness to this hair bag, it'll most likely hang on the side. Now, I did see people with like a little puffy thing, like a little puff ball on the side of this hair bag. But if I do, it'll be just like I said, it'll just hang on the side. Strap is detachable. So with the strap off, it looks like this. So what I am going to do is place this hair strap from um, the strap that I got from Amazon on here just so you can see how it looks. Strap, like I said, this is not a Louis Vuitton strap. This hair strap is from Amazon and this is the way I prefer to carry this particular bag. I prefer to carry, to carry her. And I usually carry it just like this in the crook of my arm. Carry it handheld like so to carry this bag with the strap I always will keep this attached to it like I will never take this off it'll just be like an added extra piece to the bag extraness with the extra strap now 
this hair strap you can make it long and i will show you really quick but before i show you i will show you how it looks on the shoulder so it looks if you're carrying it as a shoulder bag like i said anytime i carry it as a shoulder bag it's only because i have gotten tired of carrying it in the crook of my arm and y'all know bags like that you can get tired of carrying it like that so that you can uh switch it up my shoulder but when i carry bags like this i like to have some pockets so you know you give that extra support keep it from sliding off your shoulder um what else i wanted to say about this hair bag this hair bag longer you all you do is um detach these hair um buttons and you meet them up at the top like so and you snap them closed and here's the bag a crossbody bag let me see so here's the bag as a crossbody I mean it's not bad as a crossbody I want to see if you can see it dying because it's killing me then yeah I will carry it as a crossbody but I would prefer not to I mean I guess since I cinched the bag in really well like since I cinched the bag in and made it look a lot smaller smaller it don't look real big and bulky carrying it as a crossbody let's say within time these flaps do flip up but again I don't think that would be a deal breaker for me because the way they are placed they won't be noticeable like that yeah i wanted to get on here and show you the bag that i ended up keeping and do like a really quick review this here is my christmas bag back in this particular bag i'm gonna start with the back back side of this hair bag and just put everything in here so you can see how it looks if i do without the receipts let's see Now, some of this stuff I probably won't uh, keep in here, but for the sake of the video, I just wanted to show you that this bag holds a lot. When I tell you this bag holds a lot, and I was like, yes, Tamika, that's what you need. You got enough small bags, which I do, so. Because um, I did, like I said, just purchase a high-rise bum bag, and I felt like that was considered like a little small bag that holds just your essentials, so. Now, I'm putting everything back, things back in this particular bag. It did add weight, but it's not uncomfortable because like i said this strap is durable to hold anything like do you see how strong this hair strap is here is the inside of this hair bag now i did see that this bag do come with organizers um they do sell them off of amazon if i'm going to purchase um organizers for this particular bag if i do i will let you know i was looking at the pink organizers um so yeah went with the bigger version of this here bag like i said this is why i do prefer going in to see the bag because like i said if it wasn't for me going in i don't think i would have switched that smaller bag mine like up is too big i don't want it but going in to actually see the bag and trying it on was a big difference versus me looking at it you know the bag on videos and looking at it on the website and because like i said i was able to see it for myself it is a lot bigger than the original one that i had but it's not that big to where as though i couldn't make it work so y'all here is the bag i ended up keeping and i'm so excited for my newest purchase um love with my bag y'all i am so in love with this hair bag she is a beauty oh, now with that being said if y'all enjoyed this hair video please give this video a big thumbs up because it really helps out my channel and before i go i just want to shout out all my new subscribers all my old subscribers thank you for riding with your girl and thank you to all my new subscribers you all y'all are helping your girl reach 10,000 because y'all know my goal is 10,000 thousand by the end of this year but unfortunately, I'm not. But that's okay. Because I know 2024 is going to open up so many more doors and so many more opportunities. And I know my channel is going to definitely reach 10,000 by next year. If not, I'm going to cry. They plan, y'all. Thank you for, you know, 
um, support in my channel. And when I say support and like, I mean, thank you for understanding the luxury world. Because like I said before, and I'm going to say it again, everybody do not understand the luxury world, the Louis Vuitton world. Because I get people like, you got a hookup. And I'm like, a hookup to what? Or where you get your bags from? I'm like, the Louis Vuitton store? Like, I don't have a hookup. I get them from the Louis Vuitton store or the Louis Vuitton website. I mean, I guess because it looks like I'm constantly purchasing things. But believe me, when I purchase, I'm always getting rid of something to get something. And sometimes I'll share what I got rid of and sometimes I won't. I get them from the Louis Vuitton store or the Louis Vuitton website. And you all, because like I said, um... If you know, you know, everybody don't get luxury things. And I understand, you know, because you get people that be like, oh, my gosh, I would never. Okay, but I didn't ask. That's one thing I don't do. I don't ask nobody nothing. I have my bags. You know, you get people that say how much you pay for your bag. I don't like to really share prices. If you want to know prices, just look it up hard. Just go on the Louis Vuitton website and look it up. You know, because I just feel like that's none of your business, especially when you not in that world Would it be like, oh, my gosh, I don't like Louis Vuitton It's you know, OK, but I never asked you. But I just say that to say y'all with me with this whole luxury world and thank you for um, you like, and I really, really appreciate it because, like I said, everybody don't understand luxury, just like nice things. And I mean, I'm sure I'm not the only one. You know, when you work hard for things and you out there hustling and grinding, why not treat yourself? I'm all for treating yourself. That's always been my my thing from when I was younger. I'm all about treating myself and making sure I have nice things. You know, because if you don't surround yourself with, you know, nice things and positive people, you will always want nothing. Person, I love to be around people that have more than me, that's doing better than me, because it just motivates me, you God. know, each and every day. I know it's not about luxury, because the way my life is set up is so much more going on, but this makes me happy. So why fix what's going on in my life? But it just makes me happy. And I'm sure some of you may understand and some of you may not, but that's okay. So with that being said, you all, if you enjoyed this here video, like I said, please give this video a big thumbs up because it really helps out my channel. And also, before you go, please don't forget to click on that subscribe button and that notification bell so you could be what notified each week. That's right. Each week, your girl uploads videos. And until next time, and there will be a next time, I will talk to you later. Mm -hmm.